Hey there, it's Daniel from thegoodax.com where you can get free Google Docs templates and guides. This video is about the use of voice typing and the Google Docs. Considering that the speed of speech is higher than keyboard typing, you might find voice typing quite handy. When you need to quickly write down some notes or set a reminder, Google Docs can transcribe meetings, dialogues, and your speech. To have it saved as a text for further use and better navigation over the document. First, make sure that you have at least a moderate microphone connected to your computer, since the service relies on the quality of sound, and it will certainly be better to be used in a quieter environment, and with your head closer to the mic. And one more important requirement is using the Google Chrome browser. As it is a Google service, and the working capacity on other browsers is not guaranteed and may be faulty in different ways. On the document, it starts from you going to the Tools item on the toolbar on top, pressing it, and then in the menu going down and clicking on the Voice Typing line. That will make a little dialog box appear on the left. And before starting, you may want to change the input language. For that, press on this line and select yours in the drop-down menu. Once you're done, just press on the microphone icon. And it will most likely ask for permission to use your microphone, if you haven't activated it earlier. And we certainly allow it and it will start listening. Google voice typing is surprisingly accurate, comma, as you can tell. It also features punctuation by voice and common text commands. On the example, select as you can tell, copy, Delete, Resume, and Google Voice Typing even supports text formatting. Select, as you can tell, Underline, Bold, Increase Font Size, Stop Listening. As you just saw, besides the accuracy, it supports lots of common commands to work with text. And not only that, but has control commands, like a resume and stop listening. And this is just the beginning. Let's move the mouse cursor back to the controls window and press this little question mark in the bottom right corner of it. That will open a help menu on the right. Scrolling down, where you can find a number of commands to work with text via voice typing, offering an incredible flexibility. At first, it will be unusual to use even regular commands to work with text by the means of voice, but it certainly blossoms throughout the time and may even replace our common keyboard typing. Let's see and wait hundreds more guides and a lot of free Google Docs templates on the goodapps.com following the link below the video. Like to help share our videos to more people and subscribe to see more guides. I hope we helped you. Thank you for watching.